So turning acetal, also known as derlin, polyoxymethylene, it's a common engineering plastic. This is a piece of acetal copolymer, about uh, 80 millimeter in diameter, which I already uh, turned it down to 73 or so. So uh, I'll just show you how to turn this plastic on this Chinese mini lathe. So I removed the chuck guard which normally here because it's well the piece was too big but I normally prefer to keep it in place uh, the speed we're going to set to about um, 600 for uh, this diameter of um, material uh, we have to remember that this lathe does not use uh, brushless motors and in uh, low range of speeds it's really uh, underpowered and uh, this gives us a bit of a better torque because normally people recommend uh, taurin acetal at uh, 300-400 rpms but uh, maybe on a bigger lathe so uh, the tool a bit I use it's a uh, custom uh, sharpened yeah I wonder if you can see it piece of uh, high speed HSS and uh, the angle is about 30 degrees and uh, I made a bit of a slope here for um, chip uh, or foam to come down easily from uh, from the turning process so uh, I guess I'll just demonstrate how I do around with that So yeah, we have to clean the workpiece after each pass and remove really this whole uh, plastic foam. It's not normal cheap like you have with metal or wood. So uh, <coughs> otherwise it tends to rope around the workpiece and really uh, uh, intervene with the cutting process. So as you heard, uh, uh, if you advance too fast, uh, you can get some uh, jamming, so be careful when uh, to advance it uh, evenly and uh, smoothly. Yeah, well, that's about all to it. Otherwise, it's a nice material. Remember not to set uh, too much of a speed. Uh, uh, otherwise, it's, remember it's a plastic; it will melt at uh, high temperature, and uh, yeah, such are thermal properties of the material but otherwise it's a nice material to work in.